Out of all of the game consoles out in the market right now, the Switch probably shines the most. But even though it's a great console, it still has its fair share of issues. In this video, I'll be ranking the top 3 problems the Switch is currently having based on my own opinions. For number 3, we have the eShop. This might sound like a weird choice to add to this list, but the eShop for the Switch gets 3rd place due to how lackluster it is. While it can buy games and do the basic online shopping stuff, it really lacks in other areas. For example, you can't see other people's ratings of a game, so you have no idea how good it could be. Also, there's not a whole lot of trailers and screenshots for a lot of games. Now, this isn't the case with everything on the eShop, but for a lot of titles, this is a real issue. Some people also complain of games on the eShop being too pricey, especially for indie titles, and while that's not always the case, I can at least see what they are talking about in some games. In second place, there's the infamous Nintendo Switch Online app. This app does a poor job of delivering online gaming to the Nintendo Switch efficiently. To be honest, it doesn't really need to exist. If Nintendo built the app into the Switch itself, then it wouldn't be so harsh towards it, but because you have to have a smart device with you 24-7 just to game online with friends makes this app a complete deal breaker. And finally, the last problem with the Switch, there's the lack of media options. Software that should have been on the Switch since the first few months of its life is things like a decent web browser, YouTube, Netflix, and plenty others such as music apps and streaming apps. For some, this may not seem like a huge issue, but keep in mind that the Switch is designed to be taken on the go and to be put on a TV. And because of that, it makes these apps almost a necessity. So that was my personal three biggest Nintendo Switch issues, but what do you think of the Switch's problems so far? Let me know in the comment section below. I hope you did enjoy this video as well, and see you.